Hi guys, I'm Sonal from Sosa Candles. Welcome to our behind the scenes where I'm going to give you all a sneak peek of our exclusive Valentine's Day custom candle collection. I'm super excited to show you all how we are making this Valentine's season extra special with our 100% customizable candles. As you can see, I've got these two beautiful vessels and we also have an enchanting selection of scents. So whether you're into woody, floral or fruity aromas, we've got it all. And uh, our candles are more than just gifts. These are a sensory journey that are custom made to your preferences. So I'm going to quickly uh, remove the bubble wraps and show you all how the vessel looks like. So this is our white matte jar vessel and uh, I'll remove the other one as well. So this is our amber jar vessel. I've made it custom so that you know it gives like a nice vintagey look and uh, you know white is really really beautiful as is. It's got a mite, uh, it's got a matte texture so I love them both. And uh, because they've got these big uh, diameters, they're you know really big. So I'm going to use my wooden wicks for these candles. And uh, yeah, let us begin by cleaning these jars, and then we'll start assembling our wicks. So I'm going to gently just clean these. As you can see, they were all packed when they arrived and uh, usually they are clean but I just prefer to uh, add an extra layer of cleanliness because uh, we are going to send them uh, to your homes and we really want everything to be perfect as you'd want it to be. So yeah. These glasses, uh, these glasses we called just last year and we sold out our entire Christmas inventory. So whilst I'm filming this, uh, we've got a new batch coming in and I can't really wait for you all to sort of experience our new scents and you know, just the entire custom experience because uh, I felt like there was a gap in the market and I clearly saw that uh, the personalized candles were not available and uh, yeah, I just thought uh, to take the leap of faith and introduce it to you all and I hope you all like it. So yeah, let's begin. These have already been cleaned. We're just going to wait for a minute or so to let these dry. Until then, I'll just start assembling my wigs and I'll get my gums as well. So I've got these uh, wig stickers. Like I said, I always use them. They come very handy. And we're going to use uh, wooden wicks because uh, the diameter of these jars is really big and I want them to burn perfectly. So, and also since you know, these are a part of a very exclusive collection, uh, wooden wicks give a really nice uh, luke's feel and uh, it also give you campfire like uh, vibes and hence I just wanted to use them. And yeah, so I've assembled one wick. And I already pre-cut them so that you know they would be easy for me to use as well. All I have to do is I have to remove these glue stickers and uh, I just have to place my wick one by one on it and place it, in, place it inside of the container. So here I have my first uh, wooden wick, it's all ready. I am going to uh, place it inside of my container. It's done and uh, usually when you're cleaning your containers you might have to just give it a minute or two to sort of dry off by itself otherwise it will stay wet and uh, okay so this is the second one I'm going to place this as well I think I've got the hang of it because I make hundreds of candles on a daily basis but when you are also trying this probably just use a lot of precision because if it gets off centered one part of the candle will get a lot of heat and the other part might not get a lot of heat and that will cause you know an inconsistency so you've just got to be sure of that and uh, yeah so I have my jars ready 
all now uh, all that is pending now is to start pouring our wax and uh, so usually i you know probably take you all to my kitchen and you know we are doing all these diy thingies because i never wanted to overwhelm you all because uh, you know not everyone has a wax melter and i understand i truly get it and hence i try to do it but since we are doing this behind the scenes i just wanted to show you all uh, my workspace a bit as well and uh, just wanted to show you all my wax machine where i sort of melt my wax and uh, how i makes 100 how i make hundreds of candles in one go and uh, it's truly truly handy uh, whenever you grow or you know if you are already a business owner and uh, if you want to scale and if you're growing you can definitely you know think of getting a professional wax melter cuz uh, it's just very uh, nice and it makes your life really really easy So I've got my vessels ready, and these are my two custom scents that I made specially for Valentine's. One is uh, Love Potion, and the second one is Enchanted. These have got uh, really beautiful, sophisticated aromas, and I'm going to leave all the note details in the description as well, so that you all can check them out. And uh, yeah, so now what I'm going to do is. Uh, I'm going to start moving to my uh, wax melter and uh, get the wax so that we can pour it in to our candle jars. So yeah, I just wanted to show you all how I work here. This is a big uh, table, you know, where I pour hundreds of candles on a daily basis and just adjacent to that I have placed my wax melter. So this wax melter can easily melt about 20 liters of wax in one go and uh, it is really really helpful because uh, it makes my life so much easy i get to melt a lot of wax in a very short period of time and uh, it saves me a lot of time as well and uh, like i said you know it's very strategically placed here so you know unlike my older days i don't really have to run to the kitchen and pour uh, you know candles one by one this helps me make uh, like a bigger batch uh, in a shorter amount of time so yeah i'm really really happy for it um i'm just going to turn the tap on and pour the wax so we're going to make two scents so i'm going to pick uh, i'm going to assemble uh, and you know collect my wax as per uh, the containers so the first one is ready um always try and use these cork uh, place mats um i have also placed it here today because uh, i'm really really cautious of not making anything dirty um you know a lot of you all keep asking me how come your workspace is not dirty uh, trust me i take a lot of precautions because if you don't then uh, you know your workspace gets dirty all the time and you know takes a lot of time for you to just keep on cleaning it so i either use this or i use you know like a big uh, sheet of brown craft paper i place it before i start my work so um, i try to maintain the cleanliness because we want to work in a hygienic environment and we don't want to make things dirty and uh, we just want to make our lives easier as well so try and follow these steps uh, and you know with candles uh, sudden uh, things are always possible hence it's important that you take those uh, precautionary steps yourself so yeah i have my wax ready here i had melted it to 80 degrees only so this is the perfect temperature for me to add my fragrances so i have my beaker here i'm just going to measure my fragrance oil before i add it into the wax and uh, i am using about uh, 10% which is about uh, 15 ml here this container contains about 330 grams of wax so i am just uh, taking about 10% because uh, these uh, have really intense aromas and uh, this is like really really perfect and apt you can also go for a more intense aroma by adding um you know fragrance oil up to 12 to 13% but uh, i think i've uh, found the one that works perfectly for our candles and i'm just going to go with it and uh, yeah now i'm going to add the fragrance oil inside of my pouring jar with the help of a bamboo spoon i'm going to stir this slowly for about 1 to 2 minutes post which i am going to pour it into our amber glass jar 
सो एंड सी इफ यू फाउंड दिस वीडियो वैल्यूएबल अप एंड नाउ प्लीज डू मी अ फेवर लाइक दिस वीडियो एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल एज वेल बिकॉज दिज अ लॉड ऑफ वैल्यूएबल कॉन्टेंट दैट आई शेयर ऑन अ वीकली बेसिस एंड यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू मिस आउट सो या I'm just going to slowly stir it. See, stirring it for a minute will help uh, the wax combine well with the fragrance oil, and uh, so that it also gives you a very nice aroma when you light it as well. So take that minute and uh, just stir it nicely. I have been sort of you know waiting for this custom candle collection for a very very long time. You know we keep doing this for our corporate orders and our custom orders. You know we keep getting a lot of wedding orders as well. um wherein you know people want to give custom candles as return gifts or as invitation gifts and stuff and uh, we really wanted to uh, you know bring it to everyone to sort of revolutionize it because uh, we saw that you know there was a gap in the market where there were no personalized candles available and we wanted to change that so we just thought to launch it for everyone and yeah that is how it is now my wax is ready so i'm just going to slowly pour it into my container just use uh, like a very slow consistency and continue pouring it so that you don't have uh, any air bubbles trapped inside of your wax and it all works out fine Okay, so this is it. There is one more thing that I wanted to bring because it's like a hundred percent custom uh, candle, uh, and it's like a Valentine uh, candle. Uh, we wanted to make it a little more special. So let me quickly get that one element now. So these are our heart embeds, which we are going to add on the top of the candle. And uh, since you know we wanted to make it special for you all, I thought to add this element of surprise and not tell you all. in the beginning so yeah i'm just going to uh, pour it inside of this embed now really really slowly and it's that's it now we are going to let this uh, solidify until then we are going to start prepping for our a uh, second candle so let's begin so we are back to our pouring station i have taken another uh, uh, container here because uh, i don't want to sort of mix out all the waxes and the fragrances as well so the initial container i have kept it there and this is my second container okay the wax is ready now i'm just going to take this out cuz we're done with it we poured our love potion previously and now we are going to use enchanted again i am picking about 15% or uh, 15 ml sorry and i am going to add this to my wax it is already at a very uh, suitable temperature so i don't really have to worry about uh, you know measuring it out again that is the benefit of having a wax melter because um, since it's all already programmed you don't really need to manually check the temperatures or worry about how hot the wax has become so yeah and uh, you need to keep watching this video till the end because this is not uh, it because you know there's another level as well and uh, there's this one more thing that we do which i wanted to show you all okay it's about a minute now that we've been stirring our wax now what i'll do is i'll quickly stop stirring and i'll add it to our white container you just have to be slow and uh, consistent and continue pouring
and uh, I have a little extra wax which I told you all that I'm going to keep for the embeds. So I'm just going to add a little glitter. Okay, this is done. So now we're just going to let this solidify. And once it solidifies, we're going to top it off with a label. So I can't wait for you all to see how it is turned out. Let us come back once it's ready. So these are our two beautiful candles. We choose natural waxes and we hand pick our fragrances. And as you always see, we pour each one of them with utmost care. And uh, when you buy each one of our candles, we spread the love even further. So in 2023, thanks to your support, we were able to sponsor primary education of 20 young girls via Nannikali. So you're not just buying a candle, you're also brightening a young girl's life. So thank you so much for that. Now these candles have solidified. Now I'm going to quickly finish it off and tell and show you all how the final outcome looks like. Now let's create some magic. So these candles are already ready. I'm going to top it off with the label. I'm going to show you all how the label is so that uh, you all get uh, the reason why I'm so excited about it. I'm going to first uh, slowly apply it and then show you all. So here yeah, as you can see you can also add your custom message whatever you feel or whatever message you want to sort of share you can definitely tell us you know when you order from our website you can mention your personal message and we'll help you craft it out customizably and uh, you know like I said you can custom make your jar so you can custom pick your jars your scents and also add a heartfelt message so it's it's truly one of a kind and very very special we're just going to top up our candles with these beautiful wax embeds that we created so let me quickly show you all what i'm going to do so i've just melted the top layer of the candle and uh, i'm just going to quickly remove these wax embeds you know these are beautiful hearts i really love how they've turned out so I'm just going to add one at the side. Uh, yeah, it's here. And the second one, I'm going to put uh, for this candle. They look gorgeous and very, very beautiful. And if you're still pondering over which one to select, or if you want a, like a ready-made candle, we've got uh, a few more candles that are launched on our website and uh, they're waiting to be a part of your journey. I'm just showing you all two that we've launched and uh, I sort of, you know, hand illustrated them and I, I just really love uh, the way it is turned out. Um, so yeah, these are like perfect, perfect to be a part of your own story and you know, when you buy custom handmade things like this, it really shows uh, that, you know, the sender is really, really thoughtful and has really gone out of his way to send uh, such a beautiful gift. This Valentine's Day, let us celebrate this day in its purest form, thoughtful, personalized and impactful. Visit our website, choose a vessel that speaks to your heart and select your favorite fragrance. Top it off with your own personal heartfelt message. Our candles are going to be as unique as the bonds that you share. If you've liked this video and if you really want to purchase our candles, hover over to our website and uh, 
as you all might know i have already launched my ebook for everyone that wanted to learn in depth the candle making the ebook is on the website you all can look into that and uh, i wish you all a happy valentines day let us light up lives together one candle at a time i'll see you in the next video bye bye